Hello, class. This is Mr. Vargas again coming to you from room 325. Today we're going to do a quick introduction on the Bessler 23C enlarger, which we will be using to make prints. I'm just going to introduce you to all the levers and all the parts so you have a better understanding of how to use it. So let's get started. So number one, you have a lens. Underneath here there's a lens. Um, you never need to pop off the lens, but just know that, that you can feel it, and if you turn it, I can, I can angle it, if you turn it, you can, uh, there's f-stops, it goes from 3 all the way to 16. So uh, you can open it up wide open, or you can close it up. Alright, and you don't want to touch it, but you never want to take this off. So that, there's the lens, and then you also have to focus the lens. So this, is, this here is the focusing knob. You turn this, and it moves down. And it focuses. You go up or back and it'll focus your image as it projects onto the board. Um, speaking of projecting onto the board, this is our negative carrier. So in here is where you place your negative and then you insert this into the enlarger. The way you insert this into the enlarger, there's a circle here at the bottom. That circle faces down. There's a lever on this side. Um, it pops open. This one's already kind of a little weak, but you see how it kind of popped open? This is what, this is what our enlargers look like. These are like almost 20 years old. You slide this in, it falls into place, and then you drop it down. Um, over here is the lever to enlarge. So if I turn it this way, it, goes, it makes a bigger picture. If I go down, it makes a smaller picture. Uh, every once in a while, you come back here and you won't be able to lift this up and that's because this right here is the break if I turn this all the way it'll lock the enlarger in place so it doesn't move so if you come back and it doesn't want to move the first thing you gotta do is check the break this this is the cause of many of our problems people don't take off the break and then, and then now everything should focus run smoothly I just want to remind you that just like our cameras um, everything is very delicate these are older enlargers we want to take care of them, we want to treat them again like our dad's or uncle's 64 Impala. We want to treat everything with care. We want to be careful when we use them. And if there's ever a problem, just come find me and I will help you out. Alright, so that's our introduction. You have your, your, your uh, enlarging lever, your focusing knob, your brake. You have um, the, the lever to open up the, the bellows to put in your, your negative carrier. And you also have... Um, your lens down here. Just know that in the dark room, we're not in the dark room now, but all these are plugged into the wall, and the way you turn them on is by hitting the light switch that's in the back. We don't have it here because um, we're in the classroom demonstrating, but there'll be a light switch back here. So there you have it, kids. Um, this is a, a brief introduction to um, the parts of the enlarger. Uh, tune in next time for how to make a test strip and how to make your first print. We'll see you in class.